also vice captain of the rest of the world team. Rest of the world won the first match at Lords by an innings and 80. Barlow made 119, Sobers 183 and six wickets. Revenge for England at Trent Bridge where they won by eight wickets. Barlow 142 and five wickets. A quiet match for the vice captain at Edgbaston where rest of the world won by five wickets. But then the storm really broke at Headingley where Barlow took 12 wickets including a hat trick and the first of the seven he got in the first innings was Geoffrey Boycott. And he's gone. And unlucky, I would think. But this is a typical Barlow picker up of wickets. And that's a good delivery. It's a wicket, and Cowdery waited for umpire Rhodes' decision at the far end. But that's it. Caught behind. So once again, Sober's move has been fully justified. And Barlow's picked up another wicket. Oh, what a good delivery that was. Splendid ball, that. And uh, look at Eddie Barlow's face. And he's still not going to be off the mark. So there's no doubt about that one. See the off stump. <clears throat> well back there. So that's Eddie Barlow's fifth wicket. And he's got him. <laughs> Great performance. Got to Ness. At short forward square. Everyone around congratulating Eddie Barlow. On this hat trick. He's done him again, four in five deliveries. Ellingworth inside edge. Astonishing figures, seven for 64 and 12 for 142 in the match. Gary Sobers scored 114 for the rest of the world.